We're going to start this recipe today by making a vinaigrette. First, we're going to grab a medium-sized bowl and pour 3 fourths cup of olive oil into it. What are the health benefits of olive oil? Olive oil improves heart health, lowers blood pressure, promotes healthy skin and hair, lowers risk of cancer, prevents osteoporosis, improves digestive health, reduces inflammation. Next, we're going to add 1 4th cup of red wine vinegar. Then we're going to add one and a half teaspoon of salt and one teaspoon of black pepper. This frozen garlic is so convenient. You can find it at Trader Joe's, but if you don't have any on hand, then four cloves of crushed garlic will do just fine. Next, we're gonna add two teaspoons of oregano. Now we're going to whisk everything in the bowl until it's completely combined. Oil and vinegar will separate, so before you pour this into the pasta salad, you're gonna to wanna to mix it one last time. Now let's get started on our salad. Start by taking a large pot and filling it a little more than halfway with water. Then we're going to place it on the stovetop and bring to a boil. While we wait for our water to boil, we're going to cut all of our vegetables. The recipe calls for one full red onion, but I only used half. You can adjust this according to your preferences. Once we've added all of our vegetables to the bowl, we're going to stir to combine. Now that our water is boiling, it's time to add the penne to the water and stir. Cook your pasta according to the package. This will be about 8 to 12 minutes. Once your pasta is cooked, it's time to strain it in the sink and let it cool for about 5 minutes. Come back to the vinaigrette and give it a good whisk. Then add your cooked penne and dressing to the bowl of vegetables. Now we're going to stir until everything is combined. I typically wait until I'm ready to eat the pasta before I top it with feta. 
Once you've helped yourself to a serving, it's time to top it with feta. And remember, if Norm can eat his vegetables, so can you. I hope you enjoyed this Greek pasta salad recipe. See you next week.